Amir, coming off the Riverside Invitational here, how are you feeling first off? Just one. Um, good. Pretty good, yeah. How'd the race go for you? Um, it went well. <laughs> um, it was a, we were kind of a little bit running late, but we tried to rush it and get to the race because we were off ske schedule, so yeah. Just the bus left later. Yeah. <laughs> you, you said you ran on this course, what, like seven times almost? Like seven times, yeah. How, how does that prep you for just the end of season and everything? How does that get you mentally ready, especially winning here so early, having one of the top times in the course, course's history? Um, I mean, good because I get to experience more of the course, and then I know like where to kick or where to do the turns and everything, even though I'm still kind of struggling on that, but I hope that I'll be ready by today. What are a few things you're struggling on? Um, maybe towards the end, I think I take off too fast, and then towards the end, I don't really have that much of a kick. What are, what are a few things throughout the course? You notice where some holes are, maybe? Mm. Notice a few things there? Or, oh yeah, the one of the things that I really do memorize and, and I like is the that one hill that I take on the start. Yeah, that's, I have to, I push myself to go faster on there. Did today's win boost your confidence all heading into the postseason and, and CIF and everything? Mm, it prepared me. Um, more because um, I just had Orange County like last week and I didn't perform how I wanted but I was kind of like oh maybe if I didn't perform I'm still gonna do better here hopefully. What are your goals looking like? You almost had them, have you reached them already? Um, I haven't reached them yet but my goal was to break um, 17 again and um, maybe PR from the PR that I have so yeah.